Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Now, I know we're all very excited to be opening our voice shards this upcoming weekend because we have a 2x voice summoning happening, but I want to point some things out to you and I want to encourage you guys to hold off on opening your voice shards Friday and Saturday and at the very latest wait till Sunday. I will get to why in a moment, but I do want to share with you that it is Plarium likes to do these, uh, these events that are very close together and try to get you into baiting or jumping on pulling the trigger to open particular shards for a certain event and then and right after they're going to slam you with another huge event and i'm going to predict that there's a huge event happening which is going to be we have valentine's day coming up on uh tuesday february the 14th and this 2x event is happening from the 9th no from the 10th to the 12th and right after they're going they're probably going to be putting out a, a 10x event for these couple uh, champions like they've done in the past like every single year now if you look at my if you look at this right here this was last year guys okay we prepare something special for this valentine's day a whole streak of tennis events to summon paired champions from ancient shards sacred shards voice shards and so this from from the 11th 12th and 13th and 14th they had a number of champions lined up here coupled right where you have the zavia with the Belliner, the cupidus with the venus the flame tongue Sissio with the the cardio we have the rotos with the siffy now this is I, i'm not going to say that this is going to happen for sure where they're going to have a bunch of different champions lined up again but it's very very likely because that's what they usually did in the past right so this is most likely going to happen sometime maybe monday or tuesday or so because tuesday is valentine's day but the reason why i'm telling you to wait until sunday is because plarium likes to he, they like to put out these uh, announcements like right on the last day of time to time and I noticed that very recently from another event that happened and I did memo it because it it did stick out to me now uh, a lot of us were kind of baited into pulling for a get one get one legendary get one free kind of event and if you guys notice here now in the past on January 25th now this was actually let's go to this first on January 23rd we had a announcement for a get one legendary get one free from sacred shards or get an extra legendary from sacred shards and that was put out on the 23rd which was on uh monday so this event took place on tuesday and wednesday right so a lot of people when they see a portal glowing inside the game which is an indicator for a special event summoning happening then most people are going to end up wanting to pull their shards because they, they don't want to wait any longer right but so a lot of people did end up opening their sacred shards, trying to go for the extra summon event and to be hit on that last day of that event still happening. So this get one legendary free uh, off of uh, getting a legendary from sacred shards was taking place Tuesday and Wednesday. On the Wednesday, which is the 25th of January, they put out another announcement here where they're planning to summon or launch a 2x events uh, for legendaries from sacred shards and a 10x Prince Kaimar on top of that. So that was on during the event that was taking place for the Get One Legendary, Get One Free. So the reason why I'm telling you to wait till Sunday, so it can happen again for this weekend with the 2x voice summonings. So a lot of us are going to be very antsy and trying to uh, want to open our shards and just get it done because we've been waiting for so long and we end up pulling on Friday or Saturday. And on Sunday, it's very likely they could put an announcement for the Valentine's couple pair champions 10x event or it could be something else entirely but I'm just saying wait till Sunday because there's really no rush you can open on Sunday and it's still a 2x event going on but uh best case scenario they might put an announcement on Sunday letting you know there is going to be a 10x summons for Siffy a Yumiko or maybe even a Mara Mari and a Taurus which is what I am going for so I'm per myself I'm going to be waiting until Sunday just in case because I do have a lot of moisture saved up on my account at the moment and I want to I, I'm very I want to open on 2x summons but there's only a, a handful of champions I'm really after now like I would like to get one more arbiter to make this a plus four I would like to get two more Yumikos to make this a plus four and other than that all I'm really looking for now is Amari because Mari is an amazing amazing champion and if you don't know who mari is mari is from the banner lord summon he she mari her what's her name marishka so she is insane right 
particularly because of this passive right here. Revise all dead allies with 50% uh, HP and 75% turn meter whenever this champion is killed. So this is incredible, really, really insane. And yeah, she's really good. She's pretty much the champion that will, particularly when it comes to plan and marina pushing, will take you from zero to hero or from hero to superhero. And I can show, show you that right now. If you looked at my, uh, let me show you right here. Now, if you look at my screen here, like if you look at all the past uh, Platinum Marina finishes, like the most recent ones, Mari, 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 like Mari everywhere. Another one, uh, we got more Mari there. And then another one here, Mari, 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 <laughs> Mari. You get my point, right? So there's, this champion is insane, really, really insane for Platinum Marina particularly. And like I said, I, I, she is the champion I'm after the most. She's my most wanted. And I'm going to be waiting for until Sunday because I, I don't want to open on Friday and Saturday yet. I'm going to wait till Sunday in case we get an announcement. And as soon as we get an announcement, of course, I'll let you guys know. And if that's the case, if I see a couple paired with her and Taras, I'm going to be saving all my shards for that event because that's, that's all I really want to go for. Now, if you guys are not really interested in sniping particular champion especially if you're not close to your mercy then i would still say maybe you should just go for the uh, the 2x event instead because at the end of the day the 2x summons are still going to be your best bet at getting more legendaries whereas the 10x event it's going to be a better opportunity for you to snipe a particular champion now when it comes to the 2x events here as you can see if you go to the the default summoning chances a 2x summons event only means that your chance of getting a legendary from whatever shard you're opening from is doubled, right? So instead of a 0.5% chance of getting legendary from voids, it'll become a 1% chance of getting legendary. Instead of an 8% chance of getting an epic from voids, it'll be a 16% chance. And it's gonna be the same for the ancient shards, whereas a sacred shard is gonna go up to a 12% chance of getting a legendary from a sacred shard if it's a 2x sacred event. Whereas a 10x summons event, it's not going to be a one, it's not gonna be a 10 times whatever this is. 10 10x summons events, what that means is, once you're going it's going to be the same race as as if there's no event going on but once you hit legendary once you hit epic then you have a 10 times chance of summoning that particular champion that's in that selection of 10x pool whatever it is right so in that case all that really means is you're going to get nine of the same copies of legendaries added to that legendary pool and basically you have a 10x chance of getting that champion that's that's all it really means so the chances are still really low but when it comes to voice shards 10x events are a lot higher than it would be with sacred and ancient shards because the amount of legendaries in a void pool is a lot smaller than it is in an ancient and sacred shard pool so the chances are definitely better but but by no means is 10x events still like the best event in the world or anything like that okay um it's it's like if, if you're an early to mid game player i would still highly encourage you to go for 2x events because that's your best shot at getting more epics more legendaries Whereas a 10x is more for people that are just sniping particular champions. Now, if you're close to the mercy count, you guys know there's a mercy system in the game. If you're close to the mercy count, like right now, I'm 40 voice shards away from the mercy for my legendary. And that's why I wanted to wait for a 10x event, particularly not blow it on a 2x event. So again, if you're close to the mercy, then, then yeah, perhaps you might want to save it for a 10x event where you're trying to snipe a particular champion. But in my case, I'm just chasing after certain champions and maybe... There are some of you out there that are also chasing other certain champions and i'm actually 40 uh, shards away from my mercy and i don't really want to blow that on a 2x event so that's kind of why i want to wait till sunday to see what events might po possibly pop up maybe they'll let us know early and if they don't then i'll just make a last minute decision and say okay you know what i'll just open on sunday whatever it's still 2x event going on but all i'm saying is there's no rush there's no uh you're not hurt by not opening on sunday right because if you are pushing for platinum and you want that extra edge then you could still open on Sunday and still push for Platinum later that night. And you could still do your Minotaur runs and books and whatever. So there's really no rush to open on Friday or Saturday. Of course, if you are not really caring about these 10x events and not really trying to snipe a particular couple of champion or whatever, then you know, then you can freely open on Friday, Friday and Saturday. So those are my thoughts, guys. That's what I wanted to share with you guys. And that's the warning I wanted to give you guys because I think it is important to point that out. But yeah, let me know in the comment section down below what you guys are going to do. And if you guys are chasing after certain champions that might possibly pop up in a Valentine's uh, 10x event, I'm not saying that there's going to be a guaranteed 10x 
someone's event on Valentine's Day, but if we're going based off of the track record and what we've seen in the past, that is most likely the case. So there you have it guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope you found it informative. And yeah, maybe I'm totally wrong. I could be, it's possible, but this is just like a warning. I feel like it's uh, it should be put out there and it doesn't really hurt anybody to know or just be be cautious because again, there's no rush. There's still a 2x event on Sunday. There's nothing bad to come up waiting a couple of days just to see if there's anything that happens, right? So thank you so much for watching guys. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Hope you guys enjoy this information. And if you guys enjoy my content, please make sure to subscribe. Hit that like button. It does help out a lot. I really do appreciate it. And I'll see you guys all in the next video.